FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks, to the uh, 3 p.m. news update. Um, we're a little bit off right now. Uh, NDX down uh, 0.36. The Q's also down about the same. Gold is up today. Um, interesting with the dollar up a little bit as well. Uh, the gold contract still at 1970. Um, at least, uh, yeah, we're up for a little bit right now. We got it here? All right. Carnival selling off quite a bit after that intense run. It just seems like the market's a little bit tired right now, especially after that, after that pretty substantial run we had um, over the past month. Uh, ES trading about uh, 4,461 right now, down about 10 points. The YM down 0.19, NQ down 0.45. The Russell down a whole percent. That's been kind of jumping around quite a bit. Um, we got some big winners today. It's still going up. Uh, the CEO has been taking a lot of his, uh, you know, his stock picks off right now. A little bit as we go in uh, to the show, uh, NVIDIA versus AMD. If you take a look at AMD right now, um, they are down, okay? And it seems like for the short term, uh, the way a lot of people are looking at it, that NVIDIA uh, is, is just the winner currently, uh, and they have a lot of they have a better capability of, of making better profit in the short term. However, AMD did release uh, the Ryzen and um, their MI3000 processor, um, which will go into production and will be used by the U.S. military. Um, on a long term, this still has, you know, this still will, is a positive pick, I think, right now. The way I see it, and I'm not, I'll, I'll think about it a little bit, um, I still kind of personally, um, this is a high price point for me, but this anything in these kind of chip sectors is going to have a pretty positive upside. Um, you're looking at Microsoft, and they said they're going to experience about a 10 billion increase uh, in profit due to AI, and that just enjoyed such a positive day as well. Let's see it, well, a positive week at least. On the daily, we're moving down. It just seems the whole market is kind of a little bit exhausted, um, but. I think we'll see next week Microsoft pick up quite a bit uh, with that news, especially dealing uh, with, with China. Folks, stay tuned. We'll be right back. We've got a great hour for you, and uh, we'll have some good times. Stay tuned.